Let's listen to the bike song. Let's listen to the semi truck song. I love that song. If you want to stay up to date on all of our fun adventures, be sure to hit the red subscribe button below. Look at all those bikes fly by. Hey, that reminds me. Let's listen to the bike song. If you're looking for adventure but don't want to hike, you can put a helmet on. Put a helmet on and ride your bike. There's so much to explore and so little time. So come on, everybody, let's ride our bike. There's a bicycle for every adventure. There's a bicycle for everyone to ride. And if you don't know. So let's all teach the world how to ride a bike. Riding a bike can be so much fun. Relaxing in the cool breeze and soaking up the sun. Pedaling along, riding super fast while getting exercise. Wow, this is a blast!
out the window, there's so much to see. Mountains and cities, oceans and trees. The land far below, with colors so bright. I see green, yellow, and blue. Wow, what a sight! About a truck, it's a great big deal. It's got 18, 18 tires, tires and 18, 18 wheels. wheels. It travels across the country, only stops for meals. There's a semi truck on the run. Semi truck, semi, 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 semi truck. 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 Did you ever stop to wonder where your goods come from? Like, like your fruit and your toes and your chewing gum? gum? Well, there's a semi truck hauling it by all the time. Ton. There's a semi truck on the run. Semi truck, semi 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 semi, semi truck, semi truck, semi 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 truck, semi truck, semi 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 truck, semi truck, semi 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 truck. You can see a truck when you're on a drive on 101, 101 or Interstate 5. Catch them on the left, going 65. There's a semi truck on the run. Semi trucks, they're moving fast. Semi trucks using diesel and not gas. Semi trucks on a long, long drive. I get so excited when that semi truck arrives. Semi trucks. Semi 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 trucks. 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 Just with me. We'll see you later. Bye bye. Hey! If you want to stay up to date on all of our fun adventures, be sure to hit the red subscribe button below. And today, I'm going to teach you how I dance, which is really silly. But I don't care what anyone thinks because it makes me super happy inside. And that's kind of all that matters. So are you guys ready to dance with me? Let's do it! I'm 
gonna teach you a move. This first move is the point and pop. <laughs> I just made that up. <laughs> okay, so here's how we're gonna do it. First of all, you're gonna jump and point your toe like this. But at the same time, you can point your arm too. The point and pop. <laughs> See that? That's really fun. Good job. Now this one is the one I do a lot in all of my adventures, which is the twirl. Are you ready? Make sure you have a lot of space. Go like this. You got space? Okay, here we go. Woo! <laughs> you can try that. You can use both of your feet on the floor or maybe pick one up. Woo! <laughs> and then you can go back to the pudding pop. Wow. All right, <laughs> good job. Now the third move we're gonna do is jumping with your point, with your toes pointing out. Are you ready? You go like this, and you land on your toes. Can you do that? Good job. Okay, you can do anything with your arms too while you're doing it. <laughs> Whoa, do fast like jumping jacks. Whoa. And the next silly move is the skip and jump. <laughs> okay, so here's how you do it. You kind of skip and jump. It's as easy as it sounds. And it looks just as silly too. Try that. Okay, and here's the last move. But for the last one, you're gonna need a partner. It could be your brother, your sister, friend, or even your stuffed animal. So today, I'm gonna invite Uncle Teddy to dance with me. Woo! <laughs> okay, Uncle Teddy, you ready to dance? All right, so with your partner, you're gonna step to the side, whoop, step to the other side, whoop, and do it again, whoop, and then you can start to twirl. Good exercise. When you dance, it moves your body and it sometimes makes you get out of breath or even a little bit sweaty. But that's really good, so keep it up. Good job. Well, now that we learned all the moves, now we can dance together. Are you ready? Let's dance.
dance moves with me. Remember, it's always good to dance to make yourself feel better. <laughs> All right, well, we'll see you next time. Bye-bye. It's me, Brecky Breck, and today we're at Portland Music Company here in Portland, Oregon. We're gonna listen to music. Are you ready? Come on. Wow, there are so many different instruments that all have a unique sound and they all have a different effect on music. So we're gonna learn all about those. Are you guys ready? Let's start over here. This is Andrew. Hi, Andrew. Hi, Breaky Breck. Well, this is my friend, and he's a musician, so he can play a lot of different instruments. And we're going to look at the piano first. Wow, look at this piano. It's beautiful. Wow, can you play us something, <laughs> well, of Andrew? Of course, yeah. And this, this can be a really fun instrument. Well, since I haven't practiced any of these instruments, Andrew's going to come along and play all these for me. Yeah. <laughs> okay, Andrew, let's hear this one. All right, this one's a fun one. Here we go. Oh, boy. Dances. You guys like to dance? are called acoustic guitars. Oh boy, and they're all so beautiful. They all have a really unique sound. Wow, look at all these. Ooh, and look at these. These are little ukuleles. Those are tiny, and there's so many different colors. Let's look at them. There's blue, this is teal, pink, purple, brown, another like light blue or teal, and look at that's a flower one that's got green and yellow. My favorite colors. <laughs> wow. Look at all these. Well, hey, should we have Andrew play us a little bit on the guitar? That's a good idea. Oh, here he is. Hey, Andrew. Can we hear you play something on this guitar? Absolutely. such a clean and calming feel to it. Wow. <laughs> wow. I love it. Wow. Well, after we listen to an acoustic guitar, we get to check out electric guitars. Look at all these electric guitars. Oh, man. Electric guitars. They can add so much to music. Do you want to hear one? Sometimes when you play an electric guitar, it can sound really rocky and crazy, and they can help you portray emotions. All of these instruments can help you portray a different emotion. So, uh, Andrew, 
Oh, hey, Brecky Breck. Oh, here he is. <laughs> hey, can you play us an electric guitar? Absolutely. Oh, man. This is one of my favorites. How about like a rock song so we can kind of okay. rock out a little bit? Yeah, we can do rock. like a rock and roll kind of guitar sound. Let's come over here and maybe have Andrew play something a little bit cleaner and like jazzier. Still noisy though. I love instruments. They have so many different unique sounds. <laughs> here and pick out a little instrument to play. Whoa! Look at all these different percussion instruments. These, oh, they all sound so different. Here's a tambourine. Ooh, let's see what this sounds like. That is super cool. Well, hey, let's play the tambourine with Andrew. I was a kid actually since I was 10 years old. Wow, so mm -hmm. he's been practicing for a long time. So if you're young and you like instruments, you can start practicing at any point and you'll probably get really good the more you practice. Wow, <laughs> well that was sure fun. Thanks Andrew. Hey, do you think you could play a bass guitar? Absolutely, that'd be fun. Let's go do it. Yeah. cool looking. Look at the size of those strings on the bass guitar. They're really thick. Whoa. Well, hey, Andrew's over here. He already picked one up, which is perfect. Mm -hmm. Now he can play a bass guitar. Mm -hmm. Let's hear it. That's got such a deep sound to it. Like this one. Since this is a bass guitar and it has such thick strings, Andrew's playing with his fingers. He's just plucking the, the string. <laughs> that is so cool. Hey, let's go check out the drum sets. Come on. Whoa, look at over here. This is the percussion area. 
These are called wind chimes. Oh, wow. And this is a djembe. And these are congas. <laughs> Whoa, so many cool instruments. Oh, look at over here. This is called a glockenspiel. <laughs> That's a kind of a silly name, isn't it? Whoa. Hey, and it's a tiny drum set. Oh boy, let's see here. Oh boy. Hey, maybe we should have Andrew play a bigger drum set so we can hear what that sounds like. Come on over here. Oh, hey, Andrew. Hey. Hey, Brecky Breck. So, uh, can you play us this drum set just so we can hear what it sounds like? Of course, let's see. <laughs> Right here, this is called a snare drum. Ooh, and this is a ride cymbal. Then we have a bass drum which you play with your foot. Look at that. So you really got a multitask when you play. Go ahead, Andrew. These are electric drums, which means you can plug them into an amplifier or put headphones on. Look at that. With electric drums, you can change the volume, change the sound of the different drums. Wow, let's hear it, Andrew. This might be my favorite instrument. I love that funky sound. <laughs> wow, that was a lot of fun playing all this music. He is really good. Thank you, Andrew, so much. Thank you, Brecky Breck. You guys, if you want to hear more about Andrew's music, you should check out the link below. His name's Andrew Serino. He's one of my closest friends. He plays really good music. Also, guess what? Music is a really fun way to be creative, to learn new things, and when you play music, it helps you portray emotions and different feelings or thoughts that you have. So if you ever want to start practicing, it's easy. You can either make an instrument, or you can ask your parents about how to get a hold of some instruments to start practicing and playing. Well, thanks a lot for learning with me. We'll see you next time. Bye-bye. <laughs>
and I feel that their time is so valuable and I really want them to get to learn about and experience different things that real life people get to do. That's why we go on so many different fun adventures. So I really hope your kids enjoy these adventures with me. I hope to see you in some of my other adventures. Bye-bye. <laughs>